Hi and welcome back to Firewatch. My name is Crash and if you remember in the last episode hmm. Hey D, they left it. something behind. It's like a memo from their boss. Did it say anything of note? Uh, next few days, dropping it. Into the thoroughfare on behalf of Dr. Simmons at Wapiti Station. Wapiti Station? Holy crap. Keep reading. Oh, I just thought I would maybe, you know, stop there, let the mystery percolate. My mother always said I would meet someone who'd give me a taste of my own medicine. They're running a research site out there. Uh, he was worried about wildfires. Someone is writing down our conversations. And now we find out there's a research site out here that, that, that we don't know about? What are they researching? I mean, you and I aren't very interesting. Oh, you know, probably just horned toads. And a Wapiti Station clipboard with our conversations on it is just, what, recreation for them? I'm just messing around. Somebody is obviously up to something. I'm freaking out here. At least we know there is something real happening behind that fence. I think that we should consider that maybe this is all just a coincidence, but my gut says that there is something bad going on. Mine too. Okay. So what's next? Well, I've got an axe, so I can figure out a way to get over the ravine and back towards the site. Sounds good. Check in when you can, and keep an eye out for anyone following you. Hi, <laughs> as I was saying, um, in the last episode we found a fence. We had to go to the south of the Ruby River to find this camp that we found and we picked up an axe. So it's now... Oh, it's just a board. Now we've got to go north again. All the way up there. Now it's a supply drop. That's where we want to go there. So we're not present we're down here so is it quicker to go back to the tower and then across looks like it okay let's go first of all we got to figure out a way of getting back because that bridge was down if I remember correctly Not that I know where I'm going, mind you. I've lost the path. There it is. Hmm. So I can't cross here. get down to the ravine and get back up the other side. Is there a way over here? Well, I could probably get down but there's no way the game's going to let me get down there. Right, okay. Let's go and have a look over here. Aha! So, that was a bit of a wild swing, mate. I don't want to stand too, next, too close to you when you use that axe. Anyway, we're out. Woohoo! So, now where do we go? Can I turn left over the river? Oh. Let me climb down anywhere here. Or do I have to climb across this, looks like it, this tree? Can I get up on it even? Let me there in that way.
No, it won't. So how do I get out of here? What's that? Is that somewhere I could jump? No. Oh, okie dokies. Didn't see that before. Blind as a bat. Not like they encourage you to go up chop trees. Huh? Cool. Map time. So straight on basically. Let's see if we can make some time up. Are you there? I, I had a thought. Let's hear it. You heard someone in the bushes. Yeah. Okay, so let's assume we're being tailed. Or you are, at least. Where are you right now? Just on my way back, in and out of trees in the middle of nowhere. Do you see anybody? No, definitely not. All right, so uh, tell me what you think of this. Did you just cough? No. Did you just cough? No. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Um, there isn't any way someone, like, another lookout could be on this line, is there? No. Not without tapping our radios. Get in your tower, shut the door. Don't leave and don't use your radio. I'll call you. Understand? I will call you. Thoroughfare Tower, this is Two Forks calling you for the, oh, 50th time today. The June fire continues to move in a southerly fashion. Delilah, for fuck's sake, answer your radio. Hello, sunshine. Sorry, went out for a little bit. What can I do you for? Are you kidding right now? Did you not stay up all night knowing that someone is... I actually slept just great. Uh, okay. By the way, I was wondering if your flora of the Shoshone info poster was still up inside your tower? What? It's just protocol that those stay up. You know, info about your tower, the surrounding tree species, etc. Uh, uh, all right. Just, you know, have a look at it. Make sure it's in ship shape. Well, it looks fine to me. Yeah. Okay, yeah, it's up. Why are you acting like this? Great. Just wonderful. Do you see the tree in the top row, second from the left? Sure. It's the, uh... No. You don't need to tell me. Just, um, internalize it. it it's a great tree. And there's an area called, um, that tree's name in your sector that maybe you should take a midday hike to. Maybe. Oh, uh, yeah, okay. Um, maybe I should go for a hike. Nothing like an afternoon in the Rockies, I tell ya. Radio me the moment you get there. What? Well, so we've got to go to somewhere called Cottonwood. Let's have a look. Cottonwood Creek. Aha, uh -huh. so south again then. Yeah, he is married after all. 
Anything else I'm supposed to pick up with me? Desk drawer open. There's nothing I want there, so pick up my hat and put it on. Um, do I need a coat? No. Backpack. Open door. Grab the backpack. And we're in the great outdoors. Well, it looks a little bit breezy and closed in. I hope that fire doesn't get any closer. Uh, mind the head. Go in a sub is attraction, didn't we? Do I take the baseball? No. So south is in that direction. I am right in saying I want to go south, aren't I? You've got me doubting myself now. Yeah, it's south. Well, it sounds better down here. The wind seems to have dropped. Now we're in the actual forest itself. And here's the path. Just in the nick of time. Absolutely nobody in sight. But then only glasses anyway. Judging by the comments about the planks. But we won't go into that. Nobody saw that. Nobody, nobody, no. Right, we're down at Cottonwood Creek, so I think we cross and go right. Consult the Oracle. We cross and go right. I oh, must have been last time I just waded through. I'll go do it that way this time. I mean, I've just got. Okay, there you go. Put these back inside. There we go. I'm going to close that down. There. Not OCD at all. Right, where am I going? Here's the burn. So, across the burn, and we go right, as I said a minute ago. Right. Let's get some speed on, shall we? Not with those hairy legs. It's very speedy though, but there we go. Right, hopefully we're heading in the right direction now. Oh, apparently I can't walk and look at the map at the same time. Yes, we are. Quite a misty more morning, afternoon. Morning, I would have said. Should have been paying more attention, shouldn't I? There you go. I think that noise is just meant to spook you because it does sound. It does sound like somebody following you, as it made a sound then when I wasn't moving. 
Anyway, let's consult the map. We're right there almost. Yeah, I'm here. Honey, I'm home. Right, I'm still up a, not a bit ahead. Aha, uh -huh, what's that? Here at Cottonwood Creek. You see the cash box there? Uh, it must be around here somewhere. It is. <laughs> Find it and open it. I changed the code. It's 5678. Are you kidding me? I was in a rush. 5678. Okay. And bingo! Copy the map information, even though I don't write on the page. Oh, three blind rats. Ah, that's what we're here for. Bye bye. I've got it now. Good. I spent all day getting you that radio. I hiked to a cash box, lied to a ranger, lied to another ranger, and hopefully you are now holding a clean, untapped radio. Hopefully. Holy fuck, Henry. We have to get into that site. Whatever these people are doing is illegal, right? Tell me everything right now. All of it. You know what's going on, and you're going to tell me right this minute. Why would you think I know what the hell is going on? I, I, I snuck out in the middle of the night and figured out how to get you a new untapped radio because, because what, I'm fucking with you? The most important thing, Henry, is that we don't turn on each other. Maybe, maybe you're not real. Maybe I'm losing my mind. What? Julia, maybe it's happening to me and, and I'm imagining that I have a boss out here and that we're being spied on. Henry. Maybe there was something in the water, or our condo was underneath some power lines, and and you, Delilah, you're not real. Henry, Henry, think about her. If what happened to her were happening to you, you wouldn't even be able to realize it. Okay. Henry, sweetie, I am real, and this is happening. I'm as real as the sky is blue. Take a second, and then call me back. I'm on your side. Mm, I suppose you say parts of the sky are blue. Okay, let's call her back. Okay, I'm all right. I'm uh, I'm headed towards the site. Good. Keep your head up. Here we go. So, I am down here. That noise is all around me. I can hear it in my headphones. So, go, basically go north to the Medicine Wheel. And then on to the... I guess get to the Medicine Wheel first. Uh, across the burn. We're gonna wade just wade across is a narrow place up here. There. It's got an odd look to the sky today. Hey. Uh I just thought of something not um not great. I wish you wouldn't say things like that. What is it? a report that said that neither of us ever talked to or saw those 
girls, the ones that went missing a few weeks back. So? I'm sorry, I, I'm not following you. Henry, our radios were tapped the entire time we talked about it. Maybe even your first day when you had the run-in with them. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, yes. And now someone probably has a transcript of that entire conversation. And I've filed a report that's a blatant lie. Oh, and those girls are still missing. Yep. That's not good, is it? Hmm. Got nothing to say about that, really. Right, let's do one thing at a time. Uh, I'm at the medicine wheel. Right, okay, let me see. Straight north again. Do I report this medicine wheel in? So I'm just having a look. I don't live that far from Stonehenge. Well, I say far, probably about an hour's drive. Right, north we go. So where am I exactly? I've got to go sort of my left. Over towards the left. Obviously not over a tree. Come well, on, let me off the tree, please. More to the left. More this way. A bit more like a path. He says, going in the complete opposite direction. So, uh, skip. I've got completely turned around here. I'm at the medicine wheel. All right. So, north is over. Th is that the way? Ah, there we go. Is that the way out? Knew I'd find it in the end. Make some progress. Right, is this where the trail splits? It, it is. So need to go left. And that is left. Why do I need to hop over it when I just go around it? the tint f I just realized the funny sky is the tint from the fire ah right there's already a rope attached so let's use it the lake then so I don't want to go to the other climb I got a bear to the right up here so it's over that way yes get to the lake and turn north again I think Oh, guys, uh, not a great deal has happened. Well, quite a bit of ha has happened. Let me get to the lake first. In this uh, episode, we've discovered quite a lot about Delilah and the situation they're in. We're in. 
and we're at the lake so I'm going to end this episode here and I'll see you in the next one but until then take care